Dave Colross, I'm the current drummer for Suffocation. And I'm Terrence Hobbs, and I'm the guitar player of Suffocation as well. Guy Marche, guitar. I'm Bill Robinson, and I'm filling in for Frank Mullen. Uh, vocals. On vocals. Uh, Derek Boyer, and I play bass. Ireland at the Pint, and we're going to play kill a show for you. And drink pints. <laughs> of Guinness. And smoke hash. <laughs> On the moon. Today. Okay, yeah, well the band uh, was formed quite a while ago. Um, obviously we've had lineup changes and stuff like that, but uh, what keeps us inspired is just the fact that people have always uh, had interest in the band. And, uh, I think it's really a good thing that we can be able to come out and come across the seas and uh, go to different places in the world and actually see our fans and be able to play in front of them and actually bring the kind of music that we have to them. So I think that's the most important thing. It's fun as shit. Yeah, it is. I think he said it good, and he said it just as well. And foreign rusty trombones are wonderful. Yeah, I agree. On the day before St. Patty's Day. Yeah, it's crazy. Damn, man. Wish I was here tomorrow. <laughs> we will be. Yeah. We won't be here. It's Dublin on St. Patty's Day. Who the fuck gets to do that? We might still be on the moon. Yeah, yeah. we'll definitely be on the moon today. <laughs> I'd say it's really fun to be able to, uh, you know, see so many places, like you said. And uh, we just enjoy performing and, uh, you know, writing stuff and getting into the studio and, you know, as a group of musicians being able to collaborate, whether it's in a live performance or, uh, you know, studio or composition. And so, yeah, we're just very fortunate to be able to, to do what we enjoy and uh, it's satisfying. So it's, it's a good time. On the move. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have a you know big ham hock of an album. Uh, it should be coming out at the end of the year. It'll be called Pinnacle of Bedlam. <laughs> It'll be on Nuclear Blast Records. It's gonna be really fast, aggressive, good old suffocation stuff like you know and love from the yesteryears. And uh, that's about it. Look out for it. Get it. It's gonna be evil. He shot me the moon too while I told you about that. Just on so the moon. Know. On the moon. Yeah, we've been working on arrangements. Uh, you know, trying to come up with the. The best sister rhythms and stuff. Hobbs is a really amazing uh, composer, so to be able to work with him and arrange and, and bat some ideas around it, so it's really fun. And uh, I think the record's gonna slay. It's really aggressive and uh, it's gonna be really, really heavy. And uh, can't wait to get it out. It's gonna be really good. Agreed. They'd have to come and cook me some soul food, like fried chicken and black eyed peas and stuff like that. Now you guys can think of one. Five, you gotta pull out. Yeah, that's your chance then. I just want him to make me some soul food. Wow. Make some cornbread and shit. <laughs> See it, huh? It would be amazing to have like a. If Colonel Sanders played metal, I would say we should have Colonel Sanders cook us something. Not as much for the food, but for the night of entertainment. If, I guess if you could speak the same language, I can't think of five, but um, I, would, I would like to have Bach, the classical composer, you know, of a musician, not really a rock Rock. Star, but super. Well, you cook you? I don't care about the food as much as just enjoying the dinner. Corned beef and cabbage. He's got to cook you corned beef and cabbage. I wouldn't eat anyway. <laughs> we'd, have a, we'd have a pint together. I can't pint. think of any. Come on, well, Bill. Decrepit birth? Or what was the question? Oh, it was uh, all about an ass. Uh, <laughs> who, who would be your favorite uh, five people to cook you some? Oh, man. They'd, they'd, have, to be, they'd have to be some Mexican rock stars that I don't know because I love Mexican food. So. It's Paco de Lucia. <laughs> yeah, yes. and make some tamales. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. But I already right. have someone come to cook that's a rock star. It's Terrence. Every time I go to his house, he cooks mad ass, great I got to cook up some shit, yo. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm big into the Italian food. 
love it. It's so good. What about you, Dave? I said Colonel Sanders, man. I'd go for some KFC if he could. <laughs> <laughs> if the Colonel was a musician. I mean, he'd be beating them drumsticks. Yeah, man. <laughs> How about you, guy? I said it. I didn't hear it. Oh, that's right. Where are I, dudes? Well, there's too much that needs to be saved. But what about you just... Throw a random I know who will be for me to join. I know you know. Go ahead. I know. No, I'm not going to say it because I'd have to say my own favorite, which would be pestilence consuming impulse. I would go to Black Sabbath Paranoid Comfort. I love that. I would, put, I would put Death Human. Death Human. Another good one. Very evil. Uh, I just said there's, to me, I can't, I, there's too many. Well, you can just. If you put one thing in there. Yeah. Suffocation, effigy of the forgotten. Alright guy, what is it? I don't really have one. I can't think of one. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you he likes Barbara Streisand. He's in the closet about it. Yeah. <laughs> Rod Stewart. <laughs> Rod Stewart. No, I, I knew Pink Floyd the Wall. I knew it. Oh, uh, wow. Yeah. Or animals. Pink Floyd animals. Yeah. Wow. Not Dark Side of the Moon? No. Come on. It's overrated. Uh, just like all of them. Uh, Final Cut. No Frank Zappa? Oh, yeah. That's what we're saying. Yeah. There's way too much. It's yeah. all going to be saved. Yeah, we'd have to have same. a bowl. Ween. <laughs> ween. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> but ween, die Antwerp, uh -oh. v and no. Ah. no. Rezo. Man. I wouldn't put yeah. that in there for the world to, to know, like, as the I thing that they needed to know. Mozart yeah. would be good to save forever. Yeah, yeah. something, yeah. something yeah. like yeah. a classical Bach piece or Mozart piece. You'd have to do that, man. Some Papa Dio Chia or something like that be up in there. Yeah, I'm going to have to keep pestilence consuming your blood. I just put crack dust. That's <laughs> one out. When Ireland comes to mind is probably Jameson, Guinness, and the IRA. Uh, drinking, more drinking, and excessive drinking. Rainbows, leprechauns, and the color orange. <laughs> Green hills, uh, the cliffs of moors, or whatever they're called, and the fat fucking slabs that those fucking crazy fuckers charge like men. And women, I guess they do it too. <laughs> crazy fuckers. I, Ireland just is associated to me with my, I think, uh, my grandmother. And then... Uh, Your ability to drink. I, yeah, my ability to drink, I guess. Uh, being that she was from here. No, it just uh, it seems like alcohol it seems to be what I associate when I think of Ireland. Yeah. Last words. This is your. I pickled it. <laughs> yes. Nothing can top that. You can't. Yeah, that is, those are the best party What's words. What kind of size then? How about this one? <laughs> we will be back. Uh, I'm sticking with I Pickle Day. I Pickle Day is. I Pickle Day. Yeah. <laughs> Those are famous last words right there, no matter what. What kind size is pretty good too. A small point. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. No last words for me. What's your Silence? Last word? No. Uh, uh, that's we it. Pickle Day. We Pickle Day. <laughs> we don't Pickle Day. We pickle that. Pickle. Yeah. I'll tell them, I'll tell them what's up. We're happy to be here. We're glad that you guys are coming here to hang out and support us all. New album's coming. We love you. Stay Brutal Island. We will be back.